So probably when you think of a college dorm, you think of those tiny twin beds and a tiny little room. Yeah, not a lot of space at all, but wait until you see the brand new Anthony Wayne apartment complex at Wayne State University. Priya Mann was there today as students moved in. Wayne State has long been considered a commuter campus, but that is changing as hundreds of students are moving into this brand new facility. Loaded down with the essentials, Wayne State students got to see their new dorms for the first time. This is the first time that I lived in a room that has like a kitchen and stuff. I've always had to eat in the cafeteria, and so I'm really glad I'm going to be able to make my own food this semester. For the past five years, it's been tough to find housing on campus. Many students relied on temporary housing. This phase of the Anthony Wayne apartment complex will add 400 beds to campus. It's a new concept for us on campus. These are furnished apartments and a full-size refrigerator, um, full-size bed, dishwasher, microwave, garbage disposal, um, kind of all the amenities that they're used to having at home. Getting into any room is a two-step process. Students swipe their ID card and enter a pin. Sitting on 2.5 acres and 11 stories tall, this isn't your typical dorm. It just seems really new and stuff like that. Like the other dorms on campus are, um, they're pretty nice, but definitely not as new and furnished as this one. It's a new beginning, just like meeting the people you'll be living with for the rest of the school year. Kevin? Hi, yeah. uh, Matthew. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. 1,250 freshmen will be living on campus this year, a record for Wayne State, and classes begin on Wednesday. Everything that's done is super nice, like all the furniture in here, everything that's done is cool. And the second phase of this residence hall is expected to be completed by next summer, adding 800 beds to campus. Reporting from Wayne State, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4.